The first buildings were of timber. Later, deposits of coralline limestone and the unique coloured dolomite were found nearby and used for public buildings. Hastings Cunningham purchased Evelyn Sturt's property in 1854 and sold allotments to develop a surveyed township initially called Gambia Town or Gambiaton. He provided for a cemetery, church and school. W.A. Crouch built the first two-storey building in 1857. The school building, one of the oldest remaining, was also used as a community meeting place and for lectures by Adam Lindsay Gordon and other identities. The National Bank was first opened in this former simple cottage in 1860 with a lease for two years. The former post office in Bay Road was built in 1865 as a telegraph station. The postal services were relocated here in 1887 and recently transferred to a new site. Early civic buildings featured classic architecture. They were the Institute, Library and Hall and Town Council Chambers, built between 1868 and 1906. A benefactor to the town, T.C. Ellis of Benera Station, provided funds for the clock tower 1883. Another benefactor, Captain Robert Gardner, a pastoralist of Mount Shank Station, donated the funds for the marble fountain, which was completed in 1884. There are only two remaining original bank buildings. The commercial bank, erected in 1885, is now radio station 5SE, and the Savings Bank of South Australia, a retail store and offices. Celebrating over 150 years of the continued license of John Bing is the Mount Gambier Hotel, built on this site by Alexander Mitchell in 1862. Built on the site of the first public house for Johann and Anastasia Jens, 1884, was the Jens Town Hall Hotel, with the limestone addition in 1927. A coffee palace built in 1902 for Adolf Ruben Koenig became part of Jens as its annex for staff quarters in 1922. The former Sportsman's Arms Hotel opened in 1868, surviving until the 1920s. In 1995, the stables were restored by the Mount Gambia Heritage Society. The Lutheran Church was dedicated for worship on land donated by Dr. Wheel. In the grounds are three remaining headstones from the Michel Park Cemetery and the font from the former Bayandic Evangelical Lutheran Church. The Anglican Christ Church of England was designed by W.T. Gore. The vestry was extended in 1978 using matching stone from the first Mount Gambier Hospital in existence from 1869 to 1977. The rectory, built in 1864, is still in use with its original stables.